San Diego City Council said no to a temporary ban on motorized scooters on boardwalks in Mission Beach, Pacific Beach, and La Jolla Shores. Councilwoman Lori Zaff, who was behind the emergency ordinance, says while she's disappointed it was shot down, she's not letting it stop her mission. KUSI's Danny Roberti has more. She lost the battle, but Councilwoman Lori Zaff says she certainly didn't lose the war. I'm just not sure like what they were thinking. I want to say, you know, this is not the end of it. But she didn't hear the answer she wanted in last night's city council meeting. I was really disappointed with the vote last night. I've worked, um, you know, really hard to try and get some consensus, but at the end of the day, it was disappointing. San Diego City Council voted against an emergency ban for the summer. So these electric scooters are here to stay on the boardwalks. This is video you first saw on KUSI, a big reason why Zaff is worried. You can see two people colliding on the boardwalk, knocking a girl to the ground. She says most people don't wear helmets, but the main problem is the speed. The biggest problems are with the electric scooters because they go twice the speed limit of the boardwalk and people are zipping all around using other people as a human slalom course. The community is vocal. Many folks love them. They say it's a fun way to get around. I think they're fun. I'm up for adventure. I think they're a lot of fun. They get you around fast. I think it's just you have to be user conscious and aware, just like when you're in traffic on the freeway. The young people need it. It's called progress. Just for small trips, like, there's hard to find parking most of the time, so this is easier for everyone. Others want them to vanish, calling the scooters a menace to the boardwalk. I've been down here a long time, and my knees shake by the time I get from one end of the boardwalk to the other, and they've got to go. This is full of tourists, and they don't know, and they walk out of those cottages. It's like walking into a superhighway, you know? They're walking right into chaos. It's, it's anarchy. Now Zaff is on a mission, and regardless of last night's outcome, she says she's not giving up. I'm going to make sure that we have a lot more signage posted along the boardwalk, letting people know that these things are not legal and what the fine will be, kind of like in a carpool lane. She says her main goal is keeping the community safe. I just don't want it as somebody to be killed or end up brain damaged or, you know, it's, it's, it's scary for me. Azaf mentioned she's most worried about the speeding. The speed limit on the boardwalk is eight miles per hour, but I'm told some people can go up to about 15 miles per hour. That's why she's going to add more signs. She's going to add police officers down here and also use some of the lifeguards to monitor these boardwalks. Reporting in Pacific Beach, Danny Ruberti, KUSI News.